Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Hot Roulette. And if you're enjoying this series so far, leave it a like. Let me know that you guys are enjoying this series. And I'm going to keep it up for the end of this year. So hopefully you guys will uh, look forward to that. Anyways, we're going to get right into a few games here. I'm going to do three game episodes from now on, hopefully. But anyways, the first line's looking like Evgeny Malkin, Brian Boyle. And I know Jakub Voracek was playing amazing for us so far, but I'm, I want Evgeny Malkin to score us a couple goals on that first line. So I want someone that can set him up, and I think Matthew Shane is that perfect player. And then Jakub Voracek gets off Lemieux, Perry, Sakic, Ben. You guys know the know the players already. Parise, Kessler, Giroux, and that is our offense, or so our defense. Looking like Cronwall, Bobrovsky, Petrangelo. We got the Seth Jones, a new pickup. We got Victor Hedman. Ryan McDonough and Kevin Shattenkirk. So we're gonna get some games going. Let's see if we can win. All right, we're starting up this game. Some pretty nice Calgary Flames jerseys, and he's got Giroux, Matthew Shane, and Ryan Getzlaff on his first line. Let's take a look at his defense. Drew Doughty. He's got some good players on his team. So let's get this game going. Let's see what we can do. Oh man, we are on the penalty kill, but we're not letting up on the pressure. Oh, that was a nice shot by Giroux. Grab the puck. There it is. Grab it. Other side, other side, we got a set of Drew. Drew's got the right-handed shot, right? There it is! Shoot! Oh my goodness, almost a backdoor play. Oh, breakaway! Go, Joe Sackick, don't let me down. The backhand! Oh no, Pecorini with a big save. Nope, flying Pokerooney! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh no, no, he's still got the puck. Defuse the situation. Good job, Bobrovsky. All right, all right. Bring it out to Boyle. Right across to Petrangelo. Skate with it. Skate with it. Make sure he doesn't hit me down. Make sure he doesn't hit me down. We're cutting across to Boyle. Oh, the poke check. No. Oh, no. Ryan gets up, goes right through, and makes it one to nothing. A little bit of a backhand forehand. Shimmy, sh and he, uh, he scores a goal. So, we got to get that goal back. Dick lift. Get out of here. Get out of here. Come on. Hit him. Yeah, sit the fuck down. What? How's that a penalty? Are you serious? Come on. Oh my goodness. Perry, what are you doing? Oh, Bobrovsky, watch out. Careful. Careful. Perry, get a stick. You are no help. Uh, oh my goodness, Corey Perry, get off the ice if you don't have a stick. Thank you. Oh, please don't be a goal now just because of that. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Jesus, I know I was poking, but come on. That's a goal. Yes, we got one back. Ryan gets slapped. That's what I'm talking about. The second liner, uh, a little bit of a backhand, we just cut right in front of the net, and uh, we just tucked it right past Pecorini. Assisted by Jakub Voracek and Seth Jones. Seth Jones picking up a point, too. That's what I'm talking about. Pecorini, get out of here. Oh, come on. Ryan Kessler, shoot it! Oh, it's there, it's there! Go, grab it! Oh, no! And don't be a penalty, come on, that's just garbage. There it is. Uh, Joe's, uh, that's, um, Zach Parise, and he does draw a penalty. Oh, come on. No, 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 grab the puck. Jesus, come on. Oh, no, grab, get back, get back. We need to play some good defense. Okay, counterattack. Go, go, sauce it to boil. Boil, go. Okay, we're going to slap shot it. We're going to slap shot it. Watch the lamb chop slapper. Oh, you know what? He's open. Petrangelo. Oh, no, another save by Pecorine. Oh, there it is! Oh, no, Pecorini! Oh, man, I even tried the glitch. Come on, no, grab the puck, grab the puck. There it is, there it is, Voracek. In front, get slap! No way! Stick lift, get that. Get slap again, shoot it! Oh, my goodness. I need to score a goal right here. Uh, who's in front, who's in front? Who's in front? Uh, 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 no! And it's done. It is done, guys. Pecorini just absolutely bailing him out that game. And we do end up with a loss. Oh, boy. 12 to 12 in shots. 8 minutes time on attack to 5. We got also one breakaway as well, but nothing. First star, Gabrick. There's the two cat slaps up there. Second and third star. So, we lost to the Pittsburgh Penguins. Now we're going to have to remove a player from the team. 
disappointing loss. I am just angry at myself for not uh, doing a bit more in that game. I'm still warming up a little bit. I haven't played NHL in about 2-3 days. You guys know I haven't played Hot Roulette in a while, so I was just warming up today. Couldn't get a goal, and uh, it did cost me. So, anyways, we're going to copy and paste all of the positions into random.org once again, and le let's see what player we lose. And it's going to be the first line right defender. Another defender leaving our team once again. Let's go onto the team and see who we lose. Oh, and there it is, guys. Our first line right defenseman, Alex Petrangelo, is leaving the team. So, see you later, Alex Petrangelo. I'm sorry about that. And now we're going to also swap out. Uh, let's see. Wait, we're going to click the X button. Put back in Pecorini in net. Bobrovsky played an okay game for me, but he's a little bit fatigued. So, save changes. And now we're going to be buying uh, the 12th player, choosing that buy now minimum at 50. So, let's see what we get. Alright, everything's set up, so let's choose a 12th player. So it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Another right defenseman to fill in that spot. Not one of the best ones, but still uh, Miller on the Pits uh, Boston Bruins. I'm going to buy him out, see where he fits in. Alright guys, so as you can see here, our first line right defenseman has changed a little bit. We moved up Kevin Shattenkirk from the third line to the first. And as you can see, Miller is now on the third line playing with McDonough. So the lineups are not looking too bad. I want to play with those guys. No, I have to play with those guys no matter what anyway. So they're in the team right now. So we're going to get started into the second game here. Let's see who we're facing. Alright, another Calgarian fan. Alright, he's got Jerome McGinley. Maybe a team of the week version, the 93 one. Not exactly sure, but we got Pecorini in net. The other guy had a Pecorini last time and he played lights out, so we need Pecorini in this game to play well for us. Alright, let's see who he's got. He's got Monaghan, he's got Aginla, and he's got, uh, I don't exactly know who's on the other spot, but I think, it's, is that uh, Goudreau? No, I'm not sure if that's Goudreau. Come on, grab the puck. Okay, let's let's get this game going. Duchesne. Uh, we can get in front. Boyle! Yes, Boyle! <laughs> Oh man, he just sauced it through everybody. Matthew Shane and Brian Boyle makes no mistake, tucks it in. Past Jonas Hiller. Boyle, best hands in the show. That's what I mean. That's what I'm talking about. One of my favorite players in this game finally getting us a goal. And we just cross it. Boom! Oh, Boyle, the hands, the hands, Boyle, the hands. No! Oh man, the big man's got some moves. Oh, he passes it out in front. Oh, I thought he made a mistake there. Come on, grab the puck. We're on the penalty kill right now. Pass it back. Oh, Parise, shoot it. Yes, there it is, boys. Zach Parise once again being Jonas Hiller on the... Wait, is that the glove side? Yes, it is. He has a right-handed glove. But Zach Parise, this guy's making a lot of mistakes, and we are just capitalizing on these plays. It's now 2 to nothing. No, another one of these poke goals. And Miller pokes it in this time. And Pecorini just cannot save it. Oh, boy. All right. Well, he's got a full Calgary team, too. So props to him for actually playing with a full team of Calgarians. Joe Colborn scores him a goal. Go, get slap. Go, go, go. You're all alone. You're all alone for me. You're all alone. Shoot it. Oh, Jonas Hiller. I forgot he has a right-handed glove. We just shot it right in there. Jamie Ben, you got the jersey on. You got the jersey. Oh, no, he gets stopped there. But let's see what we can do with Corey Perry. Uh, Miller, the new pickup. Miller, Miller, shoot it. Oh, no, he just misses the net. Come on, Ben, get up, get up. Pass it in front. Oh, there it is. Yes, Joe Sackick. A little bit of a backhand. I thought I was going to miss it, but he has some pinpoint accuracy with that shooting. That's what I'm talking about. So now we're winning 3-1. to one. Let's keep it up, guys. Alright guys, so end of the second period, we're leading 3-1 to one still. Let's take a look at the stats, 17 of 5 in shots, 7 minutes on attack to 2. Not one of the greatest players I've faced, but he still has a goal. Oh, that was dirty, Malkin. I like those moves. Shoot it! No! Oh my goodness. I couldn't uh, score a goal there. Come on, get in front. Get in front, Boyle. Oh, the backhand just missed it by a little bit. Pass it to Duchesne. Malkin, you gotta get that in. Yes! Malkin finally scoring us a goal. Took him long enough, but we make it 4-1 to one with a couple dirty plays by Malkin. Oh, beautiful pass. 
Come on. You got this. You got this. We're going to backwards skate a little bit. Pass it in front. Corey Perry. Grab it. Psychic. Yes. The top right cheese beats uh, Jonas Hiller. And now we make it 5-1. to one. Still like Joe Sacking in this game so much in this game. Oh, there it is, guys. So that's going to be the end of this second game. And let's take a look at the amount of shots. We were held in Division 1. We lost quite a few games in this season, at least. And uh, we lost one in the last game as well. But uh, but anyways, let's take a look at the amount of shots. 23 to 12 in shots. 9 minutes time attacked at 4. Let's take a look at the 3 stars. And Joe Sackick with 2 goals. That's what I'm talking about. Brian Boyle with 2 points as well. And Corey Perry up there as well. So... Anyways, we're going to raise that buy now minimum to 1,000 and choose the 23rd player. Alright, so let's do this, boys. 1,000 buy now minimum has been set and the 23rd player is going to be... If it's going to search up the auction here, come on. Alright, so after half an hour of waiting for the servers to come back up, we finally can search up the auction page for the 23rd player here. So let's search and see what we get. So the 23rd player is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. It's going to be Eric Stull at 89 overall pickup. He's got some amazing stats. I know I play him with uh, my, my free pack team at least. But anyways, we're going to throw him to the team, see where he fits in. And we have found a spot for Eric Stahl, and we did take a Ryan Kessler. Hasn't really scored me that many goals, great on face-offs, but other than that, he's been non-existent. So I threw an Eric Stahl into the fourth line, playing alongside with Claude Drew and Zach Parise. So, we're going to get into the third and final game here. Let's see what we can do. Oh, that's pretty. What a great scenery. Alright, so we're playing in uh, Colorado. He's got Matt Duchesne, Jamie, Ben. I don't know who's on his left side, but we're going to get this game going. Let's see what he's got. He's got McDonough as well. We're going to get a shot on net. Oh, oh, okay, okay. In front, Matt Duchesne. No, oh, okay, let's go. Let's get this game, game going. Oh, and he gets a goal, a slap shot from the point. And then Pecorino just cannot hold on to the rebound. That's not too good of a goal for us. Now it is one to nothing. We gotta get that goal back. Oh, beautiful pass! Oh, the double backhand! No, Jamie Ben, you can shoot it in. Shoot! Oh my goodness! All right, it's end of the second period, and so far, still a very close game. One to nothing. We just need one goal, and we can tie it back up. Twelve to seven shots. Six minutes time on attack to five. Let's keep it going. Duchesne! Yes! We finally get a goal. A little bit of a cross creaser and a little bit of poking action in the offensive zone. We finally get a goal. And we beat Sergei Bobrovsky as well. So, it's now 1-1. One one. Let's keep it up. Oh! No! What? Are you serious? How is that a penalty? Joe Sackick was absolutely dangling. Scores a goal and it's not... This better be a good call. Are you serious? Come on! He didn't even interfere with him at all. Oh, fuck this game. Just fuck this. <sighs> we get a penalty for that stupid call and then he scores a goal on us. Alright, now it's 2-1. to one. Great play or great refing. To Boyle! Oh, Boyle, come on! Let's see if we can redeem ourselves after that play. Matthew Shane, shoot! Oh, okay, okay, back down low. Oh my goodness! Like, these stupid goalie interference calls. <laughs> this is so bad. It is so bad, this game. Oh my goodness. Alright, now we're losing 3-1 to one now. Get Slaff! Okay, we got one back. Oh man, I'm just so pissed off right now. We lost two goals because of two goalie interference calls back to back. Alright, we got one back. It's now 3-2. to two. Yes! Oh, we get the goal back with only 40 seconds left. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man, this game just hates me. Absolutely hates me. Alright, but now we're tied back up. 40 seconds left. 
All right, let's score another goal. Oh, yes! That's what I'm talking about. He scores on his own goal. That's payback for all those goals he got right there. Oh, man, we are now winning 4-3. to three. What a game change. How the hell do we pull out a victory out of our asses on that one? Oh, man. I'm absolutely pissed, but at the same time, I'm so happy that we were able to score three goals in less than three minutes. Jesus, what a comeback. 22 to 13 shots, 11 minutes time on attack to 7. Like, I knew I outplayed him, and we finally broke through. Once again, Joe Sackick, first star. Matthew Shane with two goals. Gabe Landeskog on his team with two goals. So... We're going to be raising that buy now minimum to 2,000, choosing a 20-second player. Oh, man, I can't even believe it. Like, that gave me my blood boil, but I can't even imagine the other guy uh, playing on the other side. I mean, losing three goals in three minutes and losing the game in regulation. That's crazy. Anyways, the buy now minimum has been set to 2,000. We're choosing the 20-second player here, so let's see what we get. And we get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, PK Subban, oh man, a 90 overall pickup and a right defenseman as well, I loved him in NHL 14, Hut Roulette, I haven't even had a chance to play with him in NHL 15, so I'm going to buy him out and see where he fits in. So we're back on the team, and this is just hilarious. I mean, just five minutes ago, I was so angry. And then suddenly, we turned the game around, and we raised that buy now minimum to 2k, and we picked up one of my favorite players in NHL 14, PK Subban, and I'm looking forward to playing with him. Anyways, he's on the second line, playing alongside with Victor Hedman, moving down Seth Jones, playing with Ryan McDonough, taking out Miller. But anyways, that's just about it for this episode. If you guys did enjoy it, please leave a like once again. I do appreciate all the support. But anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys later. Bye.